Lawyer Samir Isayev held a press conference on the criminal case against Ilham Amraslanov, the imprisoned Kyrgyz civil society activist who was actively defending the rights of the victims of 2010 Kyrgyzva floods and fighting corruption associated with the elimination of the consequences of these floods. According to the lawyer, the preliminary investigation has been finished but with irregularities. The supervising prosecutor was informed about inconsistencies in the witness testimonies and the absence of testimony from some police officers who, according to Amraslanov, assaulted him. Specifically, a policeman said by name was not brought to justice despite the suspect complained about him. The list of people involved in the arrest of the suspect was not attached to the criminal case. Amraslanov is charged under Article 228.1 of the Criminal Code, possession of firearms and ammunition, which involves hard labor for up to two years or imprisonment up to three years. He was arrested on June 8 on charges of possessing a Makarov handgun and ammunition. On that day, he was attacked by several police officers and employees of the Interior Ministry Department for fight against organized crimes, who put a bag on Amraslanov's head and forced him into a car. On the way, a local detective named Sayed put something in Amraslanov's belt. He was one of those who actively bet Amraslanov at the police office. During his arrest, Amraslanov was tortured and forced to admit that he had found a Makarov gun two months ago on the banks of the Aras River as he fed the cattle. On August 1st, the lawyer visited Amraslanov in the prison. Amraslanov told the lawyer that the pains in his body and his left ear, whose eardrum was perforated during the police assault, have decreased. The lawyer believes that this investigation does not have any prospects. The supervising prosecutor issued a decision which states that the arguments of complainants are unfounded. The case will be referred to the Sabrabad Regional Court for consideration. The headquarters of Kyrgyz civil society insists that the true reason behind the arrest of Amraslanov is his involvement in the protection of the rights of Kyrgyz flood victims. At a meeting with civil society representatives on July the 2nd, head of social political department of the presidential administration Ali Hasanov said the case of human rights activist Ilham Amraslanov will be thoroughly investigated.